In this video, I'm going to be attempting to make money from photos that I've taken with my phone in the Shutterstock Contributor app. Let's see how this goes. Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your bag with a bang and in today's video. I'm doing something a little bit different. Shout out to Ethan King for this video. I saw him make a video on it, so I had to try it. I think I must have tried it in the past. I apparently already downloaded the app. Let me explain really quick what I'm attempting to do here. So there are many different places you can sell your stock photos. You got like Getty Images or Shutterstock, Fope. There's a few others as well. But for Shutterstock Contributor, it appears that you get about 20 to 30 cents per photo download. So if you guys do not know, I have a photographer page that has quite a few uh, different photos that I've taken over the years and I'd say I'm not bad for an iPhone photographer I'm not bad I haven't really worked on this page much I've just tried to unfollow people this is kind of looking at what my, my portfolio is you guys can kind of get an idea and I'm gonna upload about 10 images I mean obviously I could go on and do you know probably a couple hundred it's gonna take a very long time so we'll do probably about 10 and then we'll see what happens after like the first day and then maybe continue to go after we see some of these results so right now it's 5 30 Thursday August 12th so I'll probably check with you guys tomorrow and then maybe the day after that we'll see how far we can go with this so you can download the app you can do everything on your phone with the app or you can also do it on the computer so i'm gonna go look through some of my photos and i'll pick some of my favorites the ones i think that would do the best and then i'll go ahead and upload those i'll show you the process of all that but i just went through picked a lot of different photos and they're all from 2018 go and upload these images now they can get rejected too i don't even know what the criteria is we'll find out and see you know like i said we're gonna submit 10 photos hopefully it works out i right, upload 10 now these are uploading and then i think I'm gonna put a description here and also some keywords and then a category. I'm just gonna use the keyword suggestions that they have. It just makes it easier. I literally just use all 30 other keywords and we're gonna submit it. I'll do this for the rest of the nine and we'll see what happens. Well guys, it has officially been a week since I first uploaded those photos onto Shutterstock Contributor. And as you can see, the side of the screen here, unfortunately, made zero dollars. I uploaded 33 images, only 10 got approved. I thought I figured their approval system out. Nobody seems to really know exactly what it is. You can kind of get a better idea, but I thought I figured it out like the first day, but apparently I did. And what I noticed was it doesn't like low light. It doesn't like macro shots. Doesn't like, it did like the one, I, I don't know. Doesn't like things kind of blur out in the foreground and the focus on the background there's the one where i had a shipwreck the background didn't like that one overall landscapes doesn't seem to like that maybe it's because it was too dark i really have no idea honestly it made no sense to me why some images got approved and others didn't so you just have to upload pretty much every single photo you got and hope the majority of them will get added to your portfolio i mean obviously it takes time to go in write a description and then you know add the keywords and it just takes time to upload stuff but you kind of have to unfortunately so i wouldn't necessarily call this a viable side hustle in 2021 because the likelihood of you actually making sales is pretty slim. I feel like even if you have really good photos, I feel like you're still not going to make good money, you know, if you're using DLSR and fancy camera. I don't know if stock photography is really going to get the job done. Now, when I tried out money-making apps, I tried out the app Fope, which is another stock photography selling platform. And I have a portfolio that's been out there for like two years. And it's probably about like 20 images out there now. I still haven't made a single cent off that. And I know there's other stock photography, you know, different platforms you could upload you could just put your stuff across all the platforms and eventually you know then you could build a more repertoire have a really good portfolio and you know some images might get approved on this site but they're not going to get approved on that site so it all kind of balance out and maybe that might be the move if you're really serious about it it's a side hustle yeah i mean i guess if it's a you know if it's a really important side hustle to you and you're really good at it then yes otherwise i don't really think it's worth your time i don't think it's worth my time honestly others may have a different experience so you can try it out for yourself i do have a link down below in the description if you want to check Saturday stock out so so stock photography, I don't think it's really the move overall. And honestly, just in general, photography is just so hard to get into. You know, building an Instagram account and building a portfolio that way and growing a little bit of a following, getting some engaged followers and maybe just trying to sell some prints that way. Sell full price prints or maybe you print them yourself or you have print on demand or something. You can maybe make it a little bit more that way just because you're going to get more per sale. Obviously here is per download. You're only going to get like 25 cents. You're going for volume here. And you know, if you have hundreds and maybe thousands of images yeah definitely you can make some money it's not gonna be huge but for sure you can make a decent buck so if you guys are new to the channel i'm all about entrepreneurship i do entertaining challenges i try out different side hustles i'm currently documenting the process of trying to become an expert at e-commerce and i've tried a couple different drop shipping challenges so make sure you check out those videos if you want to learn how to grow on instagram i have a free full course out on youtube it's got about a thousand views right now make sure you check that out 
much teaches everything I know about growing on Instagram and how to do it fast. I also have other Instagram videos on the channel. I have ones where I pay Fiverr to do stupid stuff. I've bought followers. I've done all kinds of crazy stuff. So make sure you check those out too. If there's any other side hustles you want me to try out, make sure you let me know down below in the comment section. I've tried DoorDash and I've tried Instacart so far. And of course, a little bit of drop shipping. I started affiliate marketing, money making websites, money making apps. And I got a couple other things coming soon too. So stay tuned for that. But anyways, guys, if you guys did enjoy it, if you did, make sure you go ahead and drop a like if you guys got more content. I'll catch you all in the next one.